Welcome to a special London edition of Sporty News. Today, rugby player Mike Phillips is considering a career change. Basketball player Tyson Chandler, very hot and very naked. Roger Federer, the good Samaritan. Frédéric Bousquet's predictions for London. And Rafael Nadal drives the ladies of Spain completely crazy. Mike Phillips has a great sense of humor. To get fans to buy season tickets for his club, Aviron Bayonnais, the Welsh international scrum half, accepted to become a shepherd. A friendly nod to the inhabitants of the region, which support his club. Rugby player, shepherd. The two professions have more in common than you might think. Left, 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 right, right, right. Forward, 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 forward. Lower, lower. The ball, the ball, the ball. Sure, he may need a bit more practice, but the town's shepherds now have a local star to help them out for their next transhumans. As for Bayonne supporters, they may want to start worrying. Sublime but risque. Tyson Chandler might get teased by his U.S. basketball teammates after this. The New York Knicks center, who is currently preparing for the London Games, stars on the cover of ESPN's annual body issue. The name of the issue is a bit of a giveaway, as it features pictures of athletes bearing all. So you'll get to admire hunky Tyson's tattoos and impressive build. One thing's for sure, Dwight Howard won't be doing too much teasing as he's already posed naked himself. Female athletes featured in the issue include footballer Hope Solo and basketball player Candace Parker, who'll both be competing for Team USA at the London Games. Roger Federer is so talented that he can bring people success even beyond the grave. We're not kidding. It's the incredible story of a gambler who got his winnings three years after passing away. In 2003, an Englishman bet around $2,350 that Roger Federer would win seven Wimbledon titles. Nine years down the line, Roger Federer has fulfilled the prophecy. The Swiss athlete has just claimed his seventh Wimbledon title and the man is finally set to get $155,000 in winnings. The only problem is that he died in 2009. Luckily, the money won't be lost for everyone. Before passing away, our visionary donated all his goods, including his winnings, to Oxfam. The International Confederation of Charities hit the jackpot and will be able to feed up to 10,000 families for a month thanks to this godsend. No doubt about it, Federer really is magic. More predictions from now to French swimmers. Fabien Gillot will be competing in the 100 meters freestyle in London and Frédéric Bousquet will not be appearing at the Games. I hope to bring back a medal in the 100 meter freestyle. The color, if it's gold, I'll be delighted. We'll see how well that works out. And then there's the possibility of a relay medal with the French. So if I come back from the Games with three medals, it'll be magic. And then if there's gold, it'll be perfect. I can see the French 4x100 meter freestyle relay on the podium. I see Camille Lecor disqualified. No, I see Camille for sure. He can never be certain, but Camille's a great favorite in the 100 meters backstroke. Fabien is increasingly mastering the race of the 100 meter freestyle, which is still the most difficult swim race to manage, and who's doing better and better. And I think that he'll mature at this point to swim an awesome race. Florent, from his height of 2 meters, at his young age, will shake up the world rankings in the 50 meter freestyle and upset a few, surprise a few, and will find himself in the first three. He's hot, he's too hot. Rafael Nadal has temperatures rising in Spain, according to a survey carried out by Spanish website Hoteles.com. Female users were asked with which celebrity they'd like to spend a night, and Rafa topped the polls, way ahead of Brad Pitt and Cristiano Ronaldo. Looks like the Spaniard's sex appeal remains intact, and his French Open win certainly hasn't done him any harm, far from it. Summer appears to have sent pollsters into overdrive. Another website, an American online dating service, asked internet users with which athlete they'd consider cheating on their partners with. And the answer is, drum roll please, a very happily married champion, Mr. David Beckham. He squashes the competition with over 43% of the 13,400 ballots cast in his favor. 
Cristiano Ronaldo arrives only sixth with 11% of the vote. Not enough to worry his girlfriend, Arena. As for Kelly Slater's girlfriend, she can be flattered but rest assured. Her sweetheart lands in 10th place with just over 9% of the vote. Thanks to all his shiny medals, Michael Phelps fires up women's imagination and gets an honorable 7th place.